be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Jesus said to his disciples, I tell you, unless your righteousness surpasses that of the scribes and Pharisees, you will not enter the kingdom of heaven. You have heard that it was said to your ancestors, you shall not kill, and whoever kills will be liable to judgment. But I say to you, whoever is angry with his brother will be liable to judgment. You have heard that it was said, you shall not commit adultery. But I say to you, everyone who looks at a woman with lust has already committed adultery with her heart, with her in his heart. Again, you have heard that it was said to your ancestors, do not take a false oath, but make good to the Lord all that you vow. But I say to you, do not swear at all. Let your yes mean yes, and your no mean no. Anything more is from the evil one. The Gospel of the Lord. Good afternoon, everyone. Someone asked me one time, he came to me and said, Father, do you get angry? <laughs> Why you ask? It seems that you don't get angry. Of course I do. I get angry. I, I get upset. But how do you express it? Why should I express it? I have to think first if it is reasonable to get angry. Beloved friends, in our first reading, God said, choose. He respected our freedom, our free will. Either we choose life or we choose death. In our gospel today, Jesus also telling us how is it to live our life. Thou shalt not kill. You will be liable to judgment. But Jesus went deeper than that. The motivation. There's, there is a source of that killing. Your motive. And what's the motive? The anger that you have in your heart. Now, two things that we need to see to look at this. First, if you are angry it will lead you to something bad, drastic towards the other. Either you malign, you destroy the name of that person, or you kill that person. And the other thing is that you are killing yourself. If you get angry, you keep on thinking on the person whom that person who committed something wrong against you. You cannot sleep. You are killing yourself. You keep on thinking what to do until you get to the point of thinking about revenge. So you are punishing yourself. You are killing yourself because of the wrongdoing of the others. Do you allow that? You become imprisoned of the wrongdoing of the others. That's why when you get angry, you're upset with others, think, is it reasonable to get angry? I will be the victim of that, and also, he will be the victim of my own anger. 
then release yourself from that anger. When that guy came to me and asked, do you get angry? Yes, I am. Because anger is just part of human emotion. Part of human feelings. But what is important is for us to go beyond anger. To know how to control it. And to know how to defeat that anger in you. Because you yourself will become the victim of that anger. You might get stroke, heart attack. You are murdering yourself. Now, why people get angry? Because we expect too much. We expect too much. That that expectation are not met then you get upset, leads you to anger. Somebody don't deliver what you expected from him, you get angry. Like for example, every time we hear in the confessional box, I am angry. Father, please pray that this anger will, will God will take away this anger. And I will say, no. I will not pray. Because if God take away your anger, you are, not, you are not complete. Anger is part of your human emotion. What I pray is for you to have the spirit to overcome that anger. That is important. I pray that you will be given the strength and the courage to overcome anger. That you will not be succumbed by that anger that you will not be eaten up by that anger until you die. We don't want to die with anger in our hearts. We want to die with smiles on our face, right? A joyful death because we are free. We choose to live a life that is pure. We choose to live a happy life. And that, God, and that is what God wanted us to do. God proposes. Man disposes. God proposed something. Whether you choose this way or you choose that way. Now, beloved friends, what do we choose? You wanted to choose. You wanted a life of happiness or you wanted a life of desperation. God bless you.